all right my people welcome back onto this channel thanks so much for subscribing to this channel our prayer has been that the good lord will continue to support you all in all your endeavors as you keep supporting this channel we say very big amen to that all right my people this is another one reaching us well still on the matter would you join nation no going back exactly what the people are still talking about all right on this one hmm this is another great one i think uh, the apc government right now they have not seen it that the people now have their rights to do whatsoever they wish to irrespective of what you give to them no during the Oshun State election, somebody like Bola Metinumbu spent about $200,000, like just to win the heart of the people. But right now, just like what the Yoruba Nation agitators are talking about, that no going back. The people have said no going back, no matter what. Even, <laughs> I always remember what um, Professor Banji Akinto always say that if Bola Tinumbu gives the youth money, Mekuna <laughs> Koleto, that you people should collect it. Hmm. No be on a fault. Now don't get money, but you get the money. Even the money now still on money. Make on a collect, but do not vote. And exactly what is happening right now. Well, I think you no know, the Ocean State, you no, know, the Ocean State governor right now talking about Oyitola. I've now you no know, been able to explain. You no, know, he's now explaining to people why he lost the election. <laughs> no, be small something. All right, my people. Until this one, the Ocean State Governor Boyega Oyetola has disclosed why he was defeated by the candidate of the People's Democratic Party (PDP) Ademola Hadeleke. Well, his response was contained in a test statement by his chief press secretary ismail omikwida who alleged that the all progressives congress apc did not win the election because the civil servant fell for the lies antics and the propaganda of the pdp well unto this Omipidon was reacting to the claim by her member of the House of Representatives Bamidele Salam who alleged that the Oshun 2022 gubernatorial election is the most monetized in the history of Oshun State. Well Bamidele who represents Ede South, Ede North, Egbedore Egbedore and then Ejigo Federal Constituency in the Green Chamber and the who was also the People's Democratic Party PDP agent at the Oshun Guba Results Declaration stated that the description was based on the fact that massive vote buying was perpetrated during the voting exercise well on today salam while appearing on channels tv program the gavel on sunday noted that despite the massive claims of vote buying the electorate collected the money and they still voted according to their conscience well salam who held that the election was a referendum on a sitting government added that the people issued the Adegbo Yegao Yetola administration a verdict of failure. Well, in his words, the election of 2018 was won by Senator Ademola Adeleke and then the electorate decided to retreat their decision in 2022 by voting for him again. Well, there was massive vote buying by the All Progressives Congress, APC agent. If not, the margin between the results of the PDP and the APC would have been higher. Election stipulates that the electorate must vote for something better and then different. Well, he also alleged that Governor Adegbo Yegao Yetola did not abide by the promises he made in his inaugural address on November 26, 2018. Well, he promised to set up nine agro parks in the federal constituencies in the state and then he has not done anything yet. Well, he also promised to rehabilitate the Oshogo Iwo Road, which 
it did not work on, he stated. But defending the Ocean State Governor Ismail Omikwidon, his chief press secretary, alleged that the APC did not win the election because the civil servants fell for the lies, antics, and the propaganda of the PDP. Well, Newswire NGR reports that in the election results declared early on Saturday morning by Professor Oluwatoyin Temitayo Ogundikwe, the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC Returning Officer Deleke PDP polled 403,371 and then against the 375,027 APC votes for Governor Adegbo Yega of the APC. Well, the 13 local government areas won by APC are uh, Ilesha East, Ayedade, uh, Borikwe, Ifedayo, Ife Central, Borikwe, Ola Olua, Iwo, Ishakam, Irewale, Irewale, Atakumosa East, and then Ife East, while the 17 local government areas won by PDP are uh, Bolua Duro, Oshogbo, Ila, Atakumosa West, Ifelodun, Ilesa West, Odo, Otin, Obokun, Orolu, Olorunda, Ife North, Irekbodun, Oriade, Ede South, Ejigbo, Ede North, and then Egbe Dore. Well, meanwhile, Oyetola called on his supporters to remain calm and the people of the state to go about their businesses without let or hindrance. Well, the governor also called on security operatives to ensure the maintenance of law and order. Meanwhile, Oyetola also directed security operatives to take adequate charge so as to prevent the breakdown of law and order. Well, Oshun State Governor Boyega Oyetola has disclosed why he was defeated by the candidate of the People's Democratic Party PDP, Ade Mola Adeleke. His response was contained in a tell statement by his chief press secretary Isma Hill, Omikwidon, who alleged that the All Progressive Congress APC did not win the election because the civil servant fell for the lies, antics, and the propaganda of the PDP. Well, Omikwidon was reacting to the claim by a member of the House of Representatives, Bamidele Salam, who alleged that the Oshun 2022 gubernatorial election is the most monetized in the history of Oshun State. Well, my people, majority of things, though, had actually been said right now to this. Well, the fact now remains that as far as you know, the movement is concerned right now, I think the, you know, the people right now now know what is good for them. No, the people have said it that they can no longer continue to be enslaved by all these uh, politicians and even monarchs. And that's why I love the movement, Yoruba Nation agitators, on their own part. I think this is going to go a long way because the people have said it that are not going back on the movement. So <laughs> only God knows what is going to you know, be the end of the Yoruba politicians since they have decided not to support the movement. And these people are of the opinion that don't worry. She be on see they see some people who say they still they follow now. No worry. By the time eh, the old stuff go enter them, then I go no say these people actually meant what they are talking about. Yeah, we have like you know going through the votes, at least the number of people that were there talking about four hundred thousand and then three hundred thousand. We are still talking about about seven hundred thousand people. Well, we have millions of uh, European nation agitators who you know actually say, uh, signed petition. So that is to tell you that majority you know the difference right now about maybe four points. Let's even say four point let's say four million let dash them the <laughs> the other one uh, the other one million let's say four million people we say they are not you no know, voting come 2023 that's to tell you that Yoruba nation will be definitely actualized and uh, there is nothing all these people will do about it and exactly what we are talking about all right my people this is serious that is to tell you that you no know, any person that is saying you want to go for Yoruba uh, you want to go for any other uh, party 
to vote in Yoruba land without the Yoruba nation agitation. I think that person is just wasting his or her time right now because the people did not even know come out of which definitely 2023. Hmm. That's why a lot of people are asking Tinumbu that our market. Hmm. Now you have seen it that God is bigger than your money upon all the money he spent the people still refuse to vote for the party that's to tell you that this 2023 presidential election <laughs> baba gone at your hand then day because yoruba nation have said no going back no vote you can imagine each time i remember that word 2023 the yorubas are not voting hmm. no election that is to tell you that these people only god knows where they are taking it to because right now the people have woken up yes yeah, so yoruba nation no going back and exactly what it is and then somebody has said that that is good for him now you promise the people a lot of things and then you refuse to do do you think they are they, they are now stupid do you think it's the days of uh, ankara and the uh, uh, two cups of rice and i don't understand <laughs> all right my people majority of things though have been said and uh, what more can we say meanwhile let me have your own take on this my people and remember to subscribe for more updates if you are new on this channel all right thanks and god bless